Tonight, a neighborhood heartbroken and a search underway in Sulphur Springs. This after a driver crashed into a local postman's truck this afternoon and took off. It happened on East River Cove Street and East Mulberry Drive. This is Nightside. I'm Carolina Lead. Dave has a night off. Tonight, police are still searching for the driver as we speak. 10 Tampa Bay's Hannah Deneen has been in the neighborhood all night long where this happened and spoke with neighbors. Carolina, people who live in this Sulphur Springs neighborhood tell me this was a beloved mailman who worked in this area for decades and that his loss will be felt throughout the community. He's a very good and decent man and, and to leave him like that on the side of the road is just ridiculous. A kind, reliable mailman and fixture in this community. If he had to bring something up to the porch, he put it on the porch for you. If you were out there, you could talk for a couple minutes with him. He come up, he, give, he always waving and talking and everything. He was a good person. Neighbors who knew him as Paul say he was excited for the future. He was just going to retire after almost 40 years. Now he don't get to retire. According to Tampa police, the USPS truck was hit by a dark colored Mercedes sedan. Police believe they found the vehicle involved roughly a mile away on the 8400 block of North 16th Street, but are still working to identify the driver. For somebody to leave after hitting somebody like that and just let them die, that's, I don't understand that. Neighbors say speeding is an issue in this neighborhood, and now they hope this crash leads to change. I'm pleading and begging for speed bumps. It's Tampa, Florida, so they need to get it more up to par and they have to put these speed bumps in. Anyone with video or information that could help with this investigation is asked to contact Tampa Police. In Sulphur Springs, Hannah Deneen, 10 Tampa Bay. In a statement, USPS tells us they are deeply saddened by the loss and send their condolences to everyone who loved him.